I always thought that if me and Daryl teamed up, you know, from Hall and Oates, we could be Monty Hall. Daryl Hall and Monty, see, we could kind of do the Monty Hall thing. <laughs> That's probably why it hasn't happened. Um, <laughs> No, I got, uh, somebody wants to hear the story about me and Daryl. Uh, well, uh, I've been doing that song for a very long time. That was always one of my favorite songs. Uh, even as a kid, before I even picked up a guitar or thought that I would, I, that was one of my, that was one of my favorite songs on the radio. And, uh, when I got, I got into a band with Scott Byers, actually, back in the mid eighties. And, um. Uh, it was he and I, and we had, like, every, there was a five-piece band. Everybody sang lead, so everybody picked different songs they wanted to do. And that was one of the first ones I picked. I'm like, I want to do Sarah Smile. I've never done it before. So it started there, and, uh, and I just, I've done it, you know, for, for years and years. And then, of course, it ended up on YouTube. And uh, my friend Catman... My good friend Catman put it up on his YouTube page, and it just started getting crazy amount of attention. And uh, by the way, happy birthday, Catman! Um, and uh, anyway, so I uh, eventually I got a call from uh, from my agent telling me that Daryl Hall wanted me to be on his TV show uh, live from Daryl's house. So you know, I thought about it. For like, oh my God, I remember just really taking my time and just thinking about whether I wanted to do that. I think I took about five seconds before I said, yeah, I finally, they were like, hey man, you know, what, you're taking so long, what's, what's the reservation here? So anyway, <laughs> so I went and hung out with Daryl Hall at his house and did that show live from Daryl's house and we did that song. And, uh, you know, that's, you know, there's more, there's more behind the scenes stuff, but that's the gist of it right there. It's one of my favorite songs from when I was a kid, and um, I got to do it with the man himself, and it was very cool. So, uh, what else we got? Oh, somebody wants to hear, uh, somebody wants to hear Rocket Man. I, I always want to do Rocket Man. It's just one of those songs I really, I've always liked doing Rocket Man. And um, by the way, I've, I've yet to hear from Elton John's manager saying that he wants me to perform this with Elton, but, you know, I'm still holding out some hope. Catman, go ahead and feel free to put this version of Rocket Man on your page. <laughs> you know, maybe, uh, maybe we can have lightning strike twice. I'll be up here, you know, down the road telling the story about how I did this with Elton John, and you know, to be, oh God, I'll, I'll be like, I've told this story about how me and Elton met so many times about how he did his song, and he was so crazy about me, so, anyway, I'll, I'll just have to wait. <laughs> 